Already on the 1st of December on the countdown to Christmas aren't we and we've got an excited boy I know Jess has put his shoes on all by himself this morning are we gonna take the dummy out because we don't need it because we're not tired are we or anything good boy thank you you haven't got a hood today mister's trying to put a hood up what have we done this morning what have we watched on TV who did we watch Grinch. Ginch Oh, he's not saying. We've watched Grinch this morning. We've all been up nice and early. Teddy got us up at 7 o'clock for a little feed. He had a really good night. So, I'm rushing because I've booked us to go to the play area. And I'm running a bit late because Jesse refused to get out of Teddy's car seat. So, just had a bit of an ordeal trying to get him out of the car seat because he refused to get out of it. But yeah, we're starting 1st of December off strong by taking them both to soft play. And by that I mean just Jesse because obviously Teddy is three week old so he can't do any soft play stuff. But I did this last week for the first time on my own. It is like my saviour now because Jesse can just, he just takes himself off basically into, the, into this play area. It's super secure, they can't escape, he can't escape anywhere basically because the doors are like managed by people at all times and you can only get out if someone presses the buzzer to let you out so and plus if he was going that way anyway, I would have, I would see him. But I love it here because it's massive, it's big, it's spacious, and Jesse pretty much does the same route every time for the full two hours that we're there, which is like run up and go down this massive slide, and then he just does that over and over again. And he really enjoyed it last week, and I really enjoyed it, and I cannot tell you how much better I felt for going out instead of staying in the house all day. It totally like changed my mood, and it was the first time I'd been out on my own with both of them, so. It was a positive experience. I think if we went shopping or something like that, that would be very different. And I don't think I'm even gonna attempt to take them both shopping because I'm just not even doing that on my own. Um, maybe in the future, but not right now. <laughs> so we're going back again today. I think we might make it like a Friday tradition to go to soft play because that's when I have both of them and Jesse's not at his grand's or at nursery or anything like that. And just get us out of the house for a bit. Jesse is guaranteed a nap as well after because he slept solid on the way home last week so that's what we're doing for the first of december and then we've got no other plans really apart from you know just getting in the christmas spirit doing some tidy and just the usual housework and i'm hoping when the when we get home and they're both napping i'm gonna tackle upstairs because it's not bad but upstairs always gets neglected because i always do downstairs first and then can never be bothered to go upstairs and finish off up there so i'm gonna i want to do upstairs the bed sheets need washing as well so i need to sort that out but yeah it's um i cannot believe we're in december already um i am gonna call it vlogmas so i'm not uploading every day because well i thought should i do it and then i thought hang on a sec it took me three weeks to edit a video that i filmed three weeks ago so you know it's just not gonna happen and i'd definitely be putting too much pressure on myself um whether i film every day or not i don't know i'm not against that at all i think it'll just be like what my vlogs are usually like when they're super long like a 50 minute long video you know over a few days but i'm definitely going to be filming more because there's more to film because we've got more things planned and booked in so I am still going to call it Vlogmas even though it's not every day. So I apologise it's not every day because I know last year I did it and I loved it. But it's just not doable this year with two kids. <laughs> well it is doable because I know some people do it with two kids but I just I just can't do it this year. So, but I'm still filming obviously. Anyway, I wanted to do a nice intro and show you as advent calendars and stuff but I actually need to go because we're booked in at half 11 and it's probably like 20 past and I'm just sat here on the sofa talking to you. So I'm going to go to soft play. I've got my laptop with me because... I'm hoping to do some editing there. Um, I ain't got my AirPods or anything like that because I can't find them. So I don't know if people are going to be able to hear me talking to myself on the camera when I'm editing it back. Mama! What? What you got? Oh, you're showing Teddy's muslin. Muslin cloth. Yeah, right, we're going to go to soft plate. Are you going to go down the slide, Jessie? What? 
Yeah. Oh, I was going to say you've been dead excited all morning. Have a year. Let's go then. Are you pretending to be upset? Yeah. Yeah, said jump up and down and said we're going on the slide. <laughs> <laughs> no. Right. Let's go. Oh. I'm so excited. This is one of my favorite Christmas songs ever. Jimmy's home from work. He's having cuddles with Teddy. We'll keep lifting his head up. And Jesse's here, aren't you, Mister? Hey, blow, I'm... Blow. He's lifting his head up, loads, aren't you? You all right, Jesse? Or are you burping him? Good boy. Right, I've not filmed much because Jesse has literally just okay, woke okay, up gentle. from earlier after soft play. He fell asleep in car. I think we left it. What time do we leave? Might have been about two o'clock, and it's five o'clock. He was so tired, it totally wore him out. So that's why I'm only just filming now. My plan were to tidy upstairs. I did manage to do it, but not a lot because Teddy were quite unsettled when we got back. And it's because he had loads of burps to get up and I thought he was going to do a massive sick and he didn't, but he was just a bit unsettled. So we're all home now. We have ordered a McDonald's as a little 1st of December treat. And we're going to watch a new film, which... He's not crying, he's all right. We're going to watch a new film uh, that's come out this year. I didn't even know it was coming out, actually. I've not seen it advertised. And it's called Candy Cane Lane. It's got Eddie Murphy in it. It's on Prime. And you don't have to pay for it, which is amazing. Don't you mean Donkey? Donkey. Far from Shrek. No. Donkey. Can you say Shrek? You like Shrek, don't you? So we're going to watch it because it looks really good. And then I'm hoping to get both of the boys in the bath. Not together yet, because we're not ready for that just yet. Um, we're hoping to get him in the bath after we've had his little McDonald's. So little, we've ordered quite a bit. <laughs> but it's December, so it's time to treat yourself. I am tired, as you can tell. But I'm feeling lovely and cosy and festive. I've managed to get some, I did manage to get some housework done, really, even though Teddy was a little bit unsettled, but because Jesse slept for so long, I, ma I managed to change the bins upstairs and do a st do the sterilising of the bottles which is like the biggest job to get out of the way because that needs doing mm -hmm. like desperately and I hate doing it on a night time I like to just get it out of the way and then I can chill for Mama. the rest of night. yeah what? Water. I know it's Teddy isn't it what's he doing? he's looking up oh. are you burping him? It's, it's... So I know clever. look how dark Teddy's hair is I knew we were going to have dark hair absolutely knew it and there's no way that's going blonde I don't think Look at me boys all together. Oh. Jesse changed his bum. Do you want to change his bum? <laughs> He's running off. No chance. Jimmy got a Pringle advent calendar from his mum. But it's actually only 12 days and it's 12 days of Christmas one. But you had you have opened two already. No, I <laughs> Yeah, you have. That's number two no, that you've told you, me to open for Jesse. the second one. Yeah, yeah, because you gave me permission to. No, I didn't. You did. No, I didn't. You did. You did. I'll go and show you his other ones as well. Last year I had the Temple Spa one, but I was too late this year. It sold out completely and I really enjoyed it. So this year, uh, Jimmy's mum very, very kindly bought me Yankee Candle Advent Calendar. So I've got this one and on the first day this morning I opened this. So it's the tea light one. So I've got the little tea light holder and then every day you get a different tea light and this actually smells really lovely but I don't know what scent it is because it don't tell me. So I've got this burning as well as my Wish Pan a Candle Christmas down Main Street. Guys you need this candle, I say it every time but I'm not joking, it is the best Christmas candle you will ever, ever, ever have in your entire life. It's amazing. And then Jimmy's mum also bought us this little gingerbread syrup from M&S for us coffees. Um, we've also got a Millions Advent Calendar. And we've got the Spencer Bear ones from Marks and Sparks. And then this is Jimmy's Pringle one that he has opened two of them. Are you alright? You got your hat on? 
Oh, you can't have another one of these. Oh, you want that? Right, yeah, I had to take this off Jesse because he was getting a little bit, not aggressive, but you were throwing it, weren't you? And we had to be careful of Teddy's head. Ready? Woohoo! Are you going to be gentle with it? There we go. Good boy. <laughs> So yeah, McDonald's en route, which I can't wait for. Then it's bath time and hopefully, well, mind you, I don't think Jess is going to go to bed early now with him going to, having a really super long nap, but we'll see. And then it's I'm a celeb time. We've got another one at it now. Teddy crying. Jessie, have you got bubbles in your bath? Mm. You want to get in? Yeah. Come on then. Mama. Yay. Oh, you want more toys? Yeah. yeah. More please. Wait. More please toys. <laughs> right, ready? Dog? Dog. What's this? Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Put it in then. Whoa. What's this? What noises do ducks make? What is this? What? Gingerbread man. You say it. Gingerbread man. Oh, yeah. Wet. Wet? It will be wet. Is it bad for you? What has mummy done to your hair? <laughs> Have you got a mop on? Oh, careful. Oh. Someone's cuddled up like a little burrito after their bath. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's a funny laugh, Jessie. Listen, shall we get you and your brother in matching pyjamas? Why? You don't want to wear the same pyjamas as your brother? You do? Should we put Teddy in the same pyjamas as, as Jesse? No! Yeah. No. In Santa's reindeer pyjamas. <gasps> yeah. Should we do it? Yeah. I don't know if they're going to fit in, but we can try. Should we try it? Yeah. Yeah. Come on then. Ready? Once upon a time, there were four little rabbits. <laughs> Wopsy, Mopsy, Cottontail and Peter. They lived in the woods with their mother under a great big fir tree. Oh, I'm going to tell my dear, said Mrs. Rabbit one morning. Be good and stay away from Mr. McGregor's garden while I'm gone. Well, what are they? Rabbits. Can you say rabbit? Rabbit. 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 Someone's enjoying bedtime stories, aren't you? You've requested to stay upstairs, which is not usually like him. But, yeah, he's requested to stay upstairs and get under the blanket, so I'm happy with that. Wopsy, Mopsy and Cottontail were good little bunnies and went to pick blackberries. But their mischievous brother Peter ran straight to Mr. McGregor's garden and squeezed under the gate. <gasps> Naughty Peter Rabbit, didn't he? Yeah. Advent ready? calendar opening ready? time. Two again. Look, ready? Open. Open it. Open it. <laughs> Open. You know what to do. We've got little Teddy here this morning. Open. Go on, pull. Pull. Ready? Ready? Jockey, get it! Get it! Oh. Get your jockey! Wait, not scared of me. Yay! Yay! Puts it straight That's in his mouth. You can open another one tomorrow. Another one tomorrow, Jesse. Yeah? Yeah? Good oh, boy. Oh, good boy. Is it nice? Yeah. Can mummy open tomorrow's? Yeah. Oh, thanks. Oh. <laughs> I'm kidding. I won't do that to you. I need to open my Yankee Candle one. What are we watching, Jesse? What are we watching on TV? I'd let him do it, but I feel like he'll get... Oh, yeah, he'll just want to put his fingers in wax. We're watching Mistletoe Farm this morning. I watched it last year. I think it came out last year. But it's got loads of animals and stuff in it, so I thought Jesse would enjoy it. It was a nice, easy watch this morning. We've got the Christmas tree on. Yeah? Yeah, we're all in good moods this morning, actually, which is... Rare. We're all happy. We've had uh, quite a good night, really. Jimmy really helped me out last night and well he always helps me out but he did one of the feeds so yeah that was really good teddy's fell fallen fast asleep on me he looked super tired this morning when he woke up bless him but yeah it's now the next day obviously i'm looking very bad right now because we've literally just woke up we're we're quite late actually we've got up at like half eight which is very late for all of us especially jesse who's usually up about seven o'clock but it's Saturday today, Saturday the 2nd of December, so I'll open my Yankee Candle calendar in a second with you all. But last night, Jessie just got in the bath, we read the book, and then we came downstairs, watched I'm a Celebrity, 
and I went to bed. So it was just a nice, lovely Friday night. Weren't it, Jesse? And what we're doing today? What we're doing today? Can you remember what Mummy told you we're doing? Yeah. Go on then what? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jesse and Jimmy are going to get the haircuts, which I'm so happy about because Jesse is in desperate need for his hair cutting. Because if you watched the first few days as a family of four vlog, that's when we were supposed to go to get Jesse's hair done when Teddy was two days old. And I tried to go out of the house and we had to come straight back in because we just the car seat had got jammed. So he's late having his hair cut. He usually goes every six weeks anyway, so he's gone ages and he's it needs a good cut, doesn't it, Jesse? So he's having his hair cut today. And then other than that we've got no other plans really. So I don't know. In fact, do you know what I might try and do today? I probably won't. But the conservatory is in desperate need of a clean. It is so bad. Ever since Teddy was born, we've just been throwing stuff in there. All the Christmas decorations that I ain't got space for are in there. They need to go back up in the attic. And just needs a good sort out because it's pretty bad in there. Even though we don't really use it at this time of year, even though it's a playroom because it's freezing, it's just nice to know that that room's done. But whether we do that or not, I don't know because we might end up doing something else. And I need to start some Christmas shopping, guys. I've not really got much, to be honest. And I'm not getting much this year. I say it every year, but genuinely, we're not. Me and Jimmy aren't buying presents for each other this year. And in terms of Jesse, we're not buying him any toys. I don't know if I'm actually going to end up buying him something, but we bought him stuff for his birthday and he has not used any of it. He doesn't play with any of his toys. The only things he plays with is his hockey stick, his helmet and his puck. That is the only things he plays with. So for Christmas this year, that is literally all we're getting him. We're getting him a proper stick, like a mini stick. Um, we're getting him some more pucks. We're getting him a net. And we were going to get him a proper hockey helmet, but they're actually quite expensive, like £8 for an helmet. And obviously he's not actually using it for hockey. We were just getting it for pretend play purposes. But he's got an old cycle helmet that he's happy with. So we're just going to get him bits like that. And whether I find a little bit of something to wrap up, I'm not sure. But yeah, we're not going crazy because we would literally be buying for the sake of it for him. Because he just doesn't really play with any of his toys apart from his hockey stick. That's all he plays with all day, every day, is his hockey stick. And we were going to get him some gloves as well because he's using socks for gloves. So yeah, if you're new round here, Jesse's obsessed with ice hockey. He has been since February this year when his uncle and dad started going to watch it. And he is totally obsessed with it. Are they on bikes? No. Yeah. So that's all he plays with all day, every day. Uh, so the stick he's got at the minute is actually broke. I've got a set from Amazon. It's like a plastic stick. But because he's been pressing down on it so much, it's actually like bent in half, bless him. So Jesse. What's Santa bringing you this year? Can you remember? What's Santa bringing? <laughs> Stick, good boy. What else is he bringing? Bike! He's not bringing a bike. You've already got a bike for your birthday. Bike! You're getting stick, puck. Yes. He usually says what Santa's bringing in. Yes. I think this one's ready for a feed. Yeah, are you getting hungry? So yeah, that's his plans for today. Just having a nice chilled, cosy morning. And then we're going to go get a haircut. Ding ding! What? Ding ding. Ding ding, you mean breakfast? You want some breakfast, yeah? Ding ding. Ding ding? <laughs> it's breakfast time, not ding ding. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll get you some breakfast. Jimmy is absolutely begging me to open my advent calendar because he wants to burn it. So you're going to let me do it? <laughs> well, no. Oh, you want me to, are you holding it, yeah? Yep. So number two, you've already tried to open that, haven't you? I had a little go, yeah, but you you stopped me. Come on. It's my advent calendar. Open. You've got your Pringles. Ooh, it's green. Oh, I can't get it out. I get it. Oh yeah. It says, send out festive cards early to kick off the season, right? Oh. That's like pine. Oh, is it? I yeah, love pine. It's like pine. I wish it'd tell you what. It definitely Scent is. Scent it is. Let me have a smell. smell. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to burn can't it. wait for the mulled wine one. Mulled wine? There's going to be a mulled wine one. Yeah, there will be. I wish it would tell you what it was. I know. Maybe there is somewhere or maybe I've just missed it. But yeah, I've got this one today. So yeah, we're just going to burn it every day like yesterday I used all my... Uh, this one. That one actually really nice, that. It's like really... I can't describe the smell, but it is nice. It smells like... It's like a, a sweet Christmas. It smells like a perfume. Yeah, like a really just sweet it. Perfume. Are you going to burn that one then? That smells like pine. Yeah, it I is. Know already. So yeah, I said we're not doing Christmas presents this year, are we? We might be doing. What? We might be we doing. We can't just go back on it now. 
Yeah. You've done my budget for everybody. Your budget? Yeah. How you got a budget? I know. But no, but seriously, are we doing presents or not, Jimmy? Because I've, I've, I've got it in my head that we're not. I don't know, I might get you something. Really? Yeah, but I don't know what. So you've thought of something then? No, I just don't. I, I just don't know what. Let's just not get each other out then. I mean, I did send you that ring that I like. Ring? No <laughs> it's fresh outside, Jack Frost has been overnight, it's not snowed but like there's there's like flurries of snow on the floor and it's very icy and very cold so it's just feeling more and more like Christmas every single day even though I'm not too happy with kitchen it's just not like massively Christmassy in here because it's just a state. It is because we've got 12 days Pringles. 12 days Pringles and you can open your number two. We got him Jesse yesterday. Oh yeah, we did. Hi uh, <laughs> everyone. I've not gone with the boys for the hair doing because we've just decided to stay at home, me and Teddy. And I'm gonna get some cleaning done before they get back. And maybe some editing as well, because I'm really behind on my editing because I'm just struggling to find time to sit down and just get through it all. So it's just me and Teddy who is currently fast asleep, he's just had a change and he's had a feed and the house isn't even bad to be honest, I just want to try and keep on top of it give everywhere a good hoover, just make it feel nice and cosy so we can have a nice Saturday night in watching Strictly and I'm a Celeb so it's a double whammy tonight, it's going to be a good night and also I just want to keep busy because I'm really feeling recently when I'm in the house all day I get in a bad mood, I don't know, is anyone else the same? I don't know why but like by the end of the night I'm like in a really bad mood because I love going out I love going out and just looking around shops not even to just buy anything I just love going and having a look around and I probably could do that now if I wanted to but it's a Saturday and I just know everywhere is going to be absolutely packed so I'm just going to do myself a favour and stay in and just do a bit of tidying so as you can see it's just like Jessie's usual bits on the floor you know just need to do a tidy up and it'll be messy again when he gets home but it's okay because at least I've done it <laughs> and kept myself busy and it just needs a good hoover round as well and then I'm going to do some editing and get cracking on with that but yeah I just thought I'd come on and give you a little bit of an update on what we're doing the boys have gone now they're actually going to be a while because they're going to Jimmy's dad's after so I've actually got like a good few hours to just crack on and get sorted so that means I can put what I want on TV, so I'm going to watch some Vlogmas episodes already and maybe put some Christmas films on and just indulge myself into Christmas goodness. Maybe make my a cup of tea as well, so, you know, fully treat myself. But yeah, I'll, uh, I'm going to do some tidying. I might bring you all along with me so you can see what I get up to, which is just my usual, like, overing and wiping down. Um, and yeah. current state of the playroom I know it's horrendous obviously Jesse hasn't even been playing in here because it's just too cold so he's just been bringing all the toys he wants to play with inside to the living room so it's just ended up like this because this is all the Christmas boxes that we've brought down that need to go back up because it's just causing a mess so that when we're ready to take the Christmas decorations down Jimmy can just go back upstairs because obviously they're gonna be up for like another month and then toys wise obviously it was Jesse's birthday basically last month so there's lots of toys about and then I changed all the pillars on the sofa so all the old pillars are here and it's just looking very cluttered very messy and even though we aren't coming in here like I said it's just annoying me that it's like this I, I don't know if I'm going to like fully throw my son into it today but I do think I'm going to do a bit of a tidy up just go through the Christmas decorations in here that I haven't got the space for and then I'm going to ask Jimmy if he'll kindly put them up for me in the attic tonight he'll probably be really annoyed that I've asked him to do that but we need to put some stuff up there so and look I've got like garlands in there that I've just not got the room for so but there's no point throwing them away because if we have a move house which is hopefully going to be I don't know two years guys I don't know uh, then obviously we can use it 
in a different house. But I'm just gonna get her a bit of a tidy up. So let's see how far I can get with this. I have just given up with this room. I mean, it looks better than what it did. <laughs> But I'm just, I'm, I'm leaving it. I have to just shut the door because it's just too much for me today, that room. But in here, it's looking lovely and cosy. We've got the Christmas tree on. We've got my gorgeous little teddy who is all snuggled up next to his mama. And I think he's getting ready for a feed. Look how big he's got, guys. And do you know what? These sleep suits do not fit him anymore. I've put him in this, like, literally an hour ago. And look... There's no way he can go in this again. I cannot believe it. I mean, they are up to one month and he's three a week old. So, you know, I was getting ready for the transition. And he is fitting into zero to three month vests. But, oh my God, I do, he's literally wore this, like, twice, this sleep suit. But yeah, his cheeks are really filling out now and everything. And he's just getting so big. He's just getting such a big boy and I just can't believe it. I am doing some editing finally. So I'm just like, just under halfway through uh, editing the Christmas decorations one. And I've just got some YouTube on in the background. I've just made myself a lovely cup of tea in Miss Stacey Solomon cup. I'm also really annoyed with myself because every year I always think to myself, right, you need to get Christmas bedding early and you need to get your pyjamas early. And I've left it till, la well, not till the last minute, because I know Christmas in for another, like, 23, 24 days. But with Christmas bedding and Christmas pyjamas, you've really got to get in there first, otherwise everything sells out. I, I, I can't find any Christmas bedding in Super King that, like, is in stock, and I can't find any matching family Christmas pyjamas. <laughs> so, I mean, it's not an issue. It's not a problem, I, but I would have liked us to all be matching this year because last year we weren't. Me and Jimmy wore as Disney ones that we'd had, we've had for quite a few years. I think I bought them the, maybe the first or second Christmas we had together. And I said, next year I'm going to get as new ones, not just to wear on Christmas Eve, I mean for like the whole of December period. But I just can't find any like, it, they'll be in my size, but they won't be in Jimmy's size. I mean, the boys have got matching ones, so that's okay. So I can get some cute photos of him and them and some cute memories. But yeah, I'm good to, I've just missed out. So next year, I really, really need to be on it and get my Christmas bed in and get, you know, my pyjamas sorted. But I'm really loving just this setup. And I go out next week, so I'm, I've got some good plans next week. And we're going to the garden centre. I'm just wanting something else to fill out this tree a little bit more. Like, I've seen people with these lovely flowers that they clip on. And there's just like a few gaps like there, there. That I just want to fill up a little bit more. So I'm just going to see if there's anything else. I really need to get some batteries for this. And then, for this garland here. I don't know if I mentioned this. In fact, I'll probably be mentioning it in this. I'm not sure. But if I didn't mention it, this garland was from Wentworth Garden Centre three years ago now. Three years ago? Two years ago. So that's where it's from for everyone asking. <laughs> it's from the garden centre. And it does like, well, it did light up. But silly me last year put the box where you turn the lights on, like at the bottom there. I should have like really hid it at the top. And when Jesse was like, he just, he just turned one ante, so he was you know, scrambling about, he knew, like, because, do you know what, to be honest, he has not touched anything, like, that is still there from when I put it up, that thing in there, he's barely touched the tree, he's not bothered about pulling the, de the decorations down, because he's definitely, like, grown up a little bit more now, obviously, from last year, but he sat, and he sat on the box and pulled it off, so we haven't got lights on this, but I have just found these lights that I'm hoping to intertwine on here, so then we can have a bit of lightage up there. I'm also wanting something from here light-wise, but I don't want it to look too much. And then this Christmas tree lights up on here, but I've got no batteries, and I really need to get some. I bet you any money I don't end up getting any batteries. I can guarantee you right now I don't do it. It's currently 20 to 4. It is so dark outside, it feels like 10 o'clock at night. So I'm just hoping to get this finished before the boys get home. They've just finished their haircut. Jesse looks so much better with his hair short and out. And then I really was hoping to maybe get a shower as well before the boys got home because I just take Teddy up and put him in his bam or his Moses basket next to the bath with me and just get a shower, like a really quick shower whilst he's next to me. Uh, so I was hoping to do that. And then obviously it's strictly time tonight, although Nigel has withdrawn. I can't believe it. I wonder if there's going to be a an elimination this week uh, apparently everyone's saying there's not an elimination because it's the semi-finals next week and then if they do an elimination this week there's only two people left in the final so 
if you watch Strictly, let me know, please, because um, it's my favourite thing ever. I love it so much. <laughs> I proper love it, and I can't believe there's only a few weeks left of it. But yeah, me and my littlest little man, my littlest little man are just chilling, editing, and waiting for the big boys to get home. Little boy is home with his fresh haircut. Jesse, show everyone your haircut. Have you been for it cutting with Daddy? What are you doing to Teddy? Oh, you tickling him. So I've got all my boys back now. Are you tickling Teddy? Hi, Teddy. Milk. You want some milk? Yeah. Do you? Yeah. He's still obsessed with milk. He'll have it every night before bed. And sometimes in the morning or just whenever he asks for it, he absolutely loves it, don't you? Yeah. Do you love your milk? Yeah. I think someone's still super tired. Someone's still super duper tired. Should we get you in your Christmas pajamas? Should we get Teddy in matching ones? <gasps> do you want to wear the same pajamas as Teddy? You don't understand, do you? <laughs> it's time! Woohoo! Jesse is not happy, I don't think. Is that we've just watched the Grinch because that's what he asked for and he has he's asking for it on again. <laughs> so I'll see if we can actually get through it. But I'm happy with what I've managed to get done tonight because I've managed to edit. Um, the first vlogmas episode, which is so exciting. Jesse, are you excited to have Strictly on? No. <laughs> Got sleeping little Teddy right in front of me here. And oh, it's just my idea of a perfect Saturday night, this. Isn't it, Jesse? What is it? You like this, don't you? You do deep down anyway, so does your daddy, but he won't admit it. Right, on the topic of uh, Christmas, like I mentioned earlier Don't about... Blame me. I'm not blaming you. Don't even think but, about I it. I mean, we, we, I did try to have the conversation with you the other day. Please. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy's just looking at laptop. I'm so annoyed, guys. They're, it's unreal. Only got them in like so, two do you know how I mentioned earlier, we're getting Jesse the hockey stick for Christmas and obviously I don't understand, so that's why I'm talking about People it in front of him. I know. So, the one that I wanted was the Bauer Mystery Mini Stick. And it's 24 quid, so it's not like an expensive one or anything. And it would have been perfect for him. It weren't plastic. Oh, they're not plastic, are they? That Bauer Mystery no, Mini. Uh, so, it were a proper stick. And I was like, fab, you know, kept going on website past week. Gone on tonight, because Jimmy's come out from playing his game. And I thought, right, let's sit down and let's get him some stuff ordered. And it's sold out. And I was so annoyed. Because there's been like so many times past week where I've gone on to like order it and I've just left it and yeah, they've, it's sold out. It's sold out everywhere online. I mean, we can get him another stick, but we really wanted the Bauer Mystery Mini ones. So we're just a bit gutted, aren't we? So we're just trying to find another mini stick for him that doesn't cost a fortune because honestly, I cannot believe the price of hockey stuff. It is so expensive. Like, I mean, fair enough if he wants to go into it, but it's going to be so expensive, Jimmy, if he gets into it fully. I've just seen a stick. No, it's not because he's having all Tommy's hand me downs. Oh, true. <laughs> all, all Jimmy's brother's hand me downs. I've just seen a Bauer Junior stick for £285 for the stick. Just for the stick. Mm. What on earth? We wanted to buy him a proper helmet with the hockey, with the guard on the front. 80 quid! Yeah, do you know for one of the games of the week, right? A player snapped a stick three times and I was taking a well, I was taking Mick saying that's nine hundred quid down. Well, it is because yeah. the intermediate And he went off and I says he's gutted because he's just lost a thousand quid. The intermediate sticks, some of them are three hundred and eighty five pound for an intermediate one. So expensive, but um that's why I'm gutted that the twenty four pound was sold out. We have found another one for thirty three, but I really wanted to get in the Bauer Mystery Mini ones because the collectibles as well. Yep. But he is getting one. But he not is for getting our one because my mum's got him one. He's getting the Bauer Mystery Mini. Jimmy's mum's bought it. But Jesse, can I have the other stick? So we bought Jesse this set from Amazon months ago now but as you can see the plastic and the bent in the middle bless him and he just can't play it properly he only plays it in the house but thankfully the net is still in stock so I think I'm gonna shall I order that net tonight Jimmy because I'm worried now stuff's gonna sell out yeah. we're gonna get him some soft foam pucks sorry if you're not in twice hockey you're probably thinking what is she on about and just really not interested at all but um it's what he loves it's what he loves. So we're gonna do some Christmas shopping for Jesse tonight. 
get some stuff ordered and see if we can find. Oh, you all right? <laughs> see if we can find the bowel mystery mini sticks anywhere, but I doubt we'll be able to now. They've all sold out, but yeah. No, Jesse, which one? You can have blue or orange. Which one? Which one? That one? Or do, <laughs> or do you want blue? Yes. He says yes to both. <laughs> Jesse. Jesse, do you want blue or orange? Yeah. Which? Blue or orange stick, Jesse? Which yeah. one? Which one would you prefer? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's only oh, one left that... in the blue. I think that's. Blue. I think blue. 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 He wants the blue. You want blue or orange? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>